Uh, so when we were texting back and forth, one of our, our sponsors here is MyBookie.com that sponsors our show. Promo code Drinking Bros will get you 150% of your deposit back. I, I texted you my betting slip. I've gone all in. The max bet on you is $100 for Saturday's uh, competition. The over-under is 71 and a half dogs. I'll repeat 70, that. It, that, that, that. That's a good one. Uh, I've seen other people with the over-under at, at 72 and a half. Um, yeah, the truth is, this is going to be a weird contest. There's going to be no crowd pushing me. And, uh, there's going to be, it's just going to be like, I think four eaters now it, w- it was going to be six and two of the eaters just had to pull out because of, uh, New York city's quarantine rules, mm. man. And, uh, so, so it, it's going to be a very limited field, but it's all the, all the top eaters are still there. And, uh, and it's going to be, there's going to be more cameras in the room than, than ears and audience. So. I'm a, my biggest worry is like some of the cameramen or the reporters in there are, are going to make weird noises like like gasps or like like uh, have these shocking sure. sounds that uh usually I'm just hearing cheering and, and yelling and if if it, if it if I'm I'm a little bit worried worried about the the quietness and uh, I'm hoping it, it, it's uh, uh yeah I, I, the whole thing's gonna be weird I, 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 but I, I know I can break 72 75. Uh, it's just a matter of just finding my rhythm. One would argue that because there's only four people in a room, you're not outside, uh, you don't have the heat beating down on you the entire day, the dogs will be fresher, and the buns will be fresher. Won't that allow you to push down and beat that record and go for the 75? There, there are definitely some variables that, uh, that, that, that could be favorable to, to eating more hot dogs. I... Uh, yeah, it, it, it's the dog. They're, they're making less hot dogs because there's less eaters. Mm. So the, every one of them should be absolutely done and perfect, cooked, cooked perfectly. No, no undercooked dogs that are going to be rubbery. Uh, and, but and what else? Inside, it, it, I'm not going to be sweating like an absolute madman. <laughs> I'm a little bit worried about it being too cold. If it, if it's cold, then it's hard to get amped up. If it's also cold, then the hot dogs will will. Uh, Will will cool down more and, and end up being a little bit rubbery. You, nobody wants to eat cold hot dogs. Um, but uh, if, and and then the, the quiet room. I'm 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 a little I'm a little bit. It, it, it's just it's unnatural to uh, eat when in a quiet room. Usually, if I'm practicing, it, it's loud music playing and somebody yelling at me. Uh, yeah. And, and Fourth of July, I'm I'm used to having the audience push me. So they're they're they're. I'm not going in there thinking it's going to be easy. There, there is a chance it, uh, uh, the scenario is going to be perfect for a world record, mm-hmm. but uh, I, I just need to. No, no matter what, I need to go out there hungry and just try to find that rhythm, what? the rhythm where I'm just moving the food down. Yeah, and literally hungry on this one. But um, uh, I don't know if you've watched the UFC because the UFC is back, and a lot of the fighters say they can hear the announcers. The guy you're talking about, George O'Shea, is hilarious. George, yeah, he's he's. I, I feel like you should if you. How, how many of these have you won now? Twelve, right? Yeah, I've won twelve, and George is amazing. And he the things that come out of his mouth. Uh, sometimes they're funny, mm. and they're they're a little bit lighthearted. But usually it, it's it's like he he tries to build people up, like, and he makes me believe that all right, I I could I could eat eat a tank if it was if it was driving in front of me right now. <laughs> I, 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 could, I could do whatever I need to do, and. Uh, and even when I feel like I'm slowing down, he's telling me I, I can dig deeper. So uh, I, I'm really hoping he brings out his A game and pushes me. Uh, I know it, it's going to be it's going to be different. There's no audience. It's going to be different, not just for eaters, but it, for the people watching at home. Uh, it, it's going to it's going to look different. Uh, usually they they can pan out the camera out, and you'll you can see 20 eaters and, and an audience. This one there's going to be four, maybe six eaters, and. Uh, so it's going to be a lot more close-ups. It's not going to be as pretty. Uh, not that I'm ever pretty, but uh, it's going to be. <laughs> people are going to see see how hard I'm working. I think maybe there's, a little bit more. Yeah, there's not much of an aesthetic to a hot dog eating contest. Really. No, no. Although I feel no, like no. Uh, George Shea's hat is is the thing that brings everything together. I and it, after 12 wins, you should probably get his hat. I feel like. Yeah, that carnival barker. Yeah, hat, he right? you got to like he should have surrendered that to you years ago. Oh, I, he can keep that. That thing is sweaty. <laughs> 